was the MVP tonight. Also, Jordan Battles. Uh, gentlemen, uh, we'll start with Bryce. If you could just give an opening comment, your reaction to tonight's uh, game. Bryce? Yeah. Um, yeah, it was a, uh, obviously a, a huge win for us. Um, I'm, I'm super, you know, super excited, super, super happy for the team. Um, kind of what Coach was saying is, you know, just creating that opportunity for us. Um, you know, we, we know there's a long road ahead. We have that, you know, we're, we're hoping to get into that two, two team season. So um, we got, you know, the, that two game season to prepare for. And, you know, it, it's a good one. We have the 24 hour rule, and then we'll get back at it. Michael Custer at AL.com for Nick and Bryce. What changed in that second quarter offensively where things were struggling a little bit in the first quarter, but really exploded in the second? Um, you know, I, I think, you know, I think it was just, just us as a whole, you know. Obviously, we wanted to get out to a better start than we did, but um, you know, I think we all stepped up and we all answered the bell. We all understood, you know, what was what was at stake. We all understood that we needed to step up. So, um, you know, I'm, I'm blessed to have the teammates I do that. You know, when when the, our back's kind of against the wall, we understand to need to have a type situation. We kind of got our spark and and, and started moving. So, you know, I'm, I'm happy we started to get going when we did. Bryce, how much? Usually, the offensive line only gets attention from us when they give up seven sacks or something, but. How much did those guys impact this game against that defensive front? Yeah, that was that was everything. Um, you know, it was obviously that's a that's a great front, a great defense, and we knew that coming in. And you know, I think they just kept hearing it and hearing it. And uh, like Coach said, they accepted the challenge and they really stepped up to the plate. You know, in the biggest moment in the season. So, um, in all the success that we have offensively, it always starts up front. So I, I'm glad that you said that. Um, you know, you only hear about people try to only say negative things about offensive lines in general and about our own line, but you don't understand every time that there's a positive play, and whether it's the run game, the pass game, whatever it is, nothing starts without our own line. And they did an amazing job today. They stepped up to the plate, and I'm happy to, to have the guys that I do. Okay, we'll go over here on our left hand side. Uh, Nick and, and Bryce, well, why were you guys able to have so much success uh, against Georgia's defense today and make them do things they haven't seen? them do much this season. Bryce, you want to go ahead with that one? Yes, so. Yes, so. Um, yeah, I think, again, I think, um, you know, that was, a, that was a really good defense. Um, you know, had, you know, had, you know, really good players, great, great coaching. And, um, you know, I think it was just about how we prepared. Um, you know, we, we kind of wanted to all as offense take that challenge. And, you know, you, like, like Coach is saying, you hear the, you hear the rat poison. And it was, it was kind of against us this week. And, you know, we, we, we took preparation very seriously. And we all understood the magnitude of the moment, and we all stepped up. So um, it was, it was, it was the, everybody, all 11. It was the coaches doing a great job, calling plays, managing situations. So it was a team effort, and we know that it was, you know, it was a great win, and we have to keep on improving. In third row, Blake Topmeyer, USA Today Network. Uh, for Nick or, or the players, um, could you foresee this coming? Was there any indication, you know, throughout this week that a performance like this maybe was was coming this weekend? You know, I'd say we always have, you know, we always have faith and confidence in each other. Um, as a player, we always have faith and confidence in the coaching staff. Um, so for us, um, you know, I don't think we ever really blinked or, or wavered. We understood the, the work that was necessary during the week. And we understood what we had to do to prepare. But, um, you know, we, we, we always have confidence in each other. We always believe in each other and push each other. So, um, you know, I, I think we're, we're all confident going in. I Bryce, talk about the variety of guys that helped you on offense this evening. Yeah, there's there's a lot of guys that stepped up, with you know with with people being down, with um, you know with just having to have rotation. Um, you know, I think I think coach spoke to it well with with the confidence that I have in them, and that's that's confidence in seeing how they work um, throughout the week, seeing how they work in the off season. Um, so for me, um, you know, even when it is you know the next man up, and it's not someone that might be particularly familiar to the you know to the field, you know, I, I see how they work throughout the week, and and the guys that that stepped up. Um, I, I had complete confidence, complete you know trust and faith in them, and you know they, we kind of built that rapport through through how hard they work. So um, you know for those guys to step up in a moment like we did, um, you know it was it was definitely big for us.